In this video, we'll explain how you can make an ultrasound up until week 20 of your pregnancy. Everyone can make an ultrasound, especially after watching this video. The only thing you need is a little patience and some practice. It's going to be your first time after all. Lay back a little and get comfy. You can keep your clothing clean with some tissues. Be sure to have some on hand to clean up the gel when you're all done. This is the probe. It's the device's camera. Always keep your thumb on the marking on the side so you don't accidentally hold the camera upside down. It will help you prevent looking in mirrored image and getting confused. Apply a generous amount of scan gel onto the probe. Too little will result in poor image quality if the probe doesn't slide as smoothly over your belly anymore. Or if you see the picture is getting a bit unclear, it's time to add some more gel. At this stage, your uterus and baby are still very tiny and low in your belly. The shorter you've been pregnant for, the lower you should start. In early stages of pregnancy, your baby can still move around freely. So chances are you can find your little one a bit more to either side of your belly. Move the probe in oval motions across your belly until you find your baby. When moving the probe, go slow. This will help you get the best picture. Your baby can lay horizontally or vertically, so sometimes you'll get a better view if you turn or tilt the probe. It's okay to put some pressure on the probe. If the probe isn't placed firmly against your skin, the picture won't be as clear as you'd want it to be. If you've already had an ultrasound, you know how much pressure you can put on it. Just don't hurt yourself and it will be fine. When you're just starting, it can be a bit tricky to know what to look for. Luckily, there are some easily recognizable features. The white spots are the baby's bones. The bubbles you see are usually the hands or feet and a large circle is your baby's head. If the little one's position is favorable, you can even see their eyes. The black areas are cavities with fluid, like the stomach, bladder, and heart chambers. The amniotic fluid is also black. If you see a blinking spot, you found the heart. So beautiful. Your baby is still very small. It could be helpful to zoom in and out. You can do this by simply clicking on the plus or minus in the software. How clear your picture is going to be depends on several things. For instance, your body fat percentage, the location of the placenta and your baby's position. Your little one could be camera shy and hide just when you're about to make an ultrasound. You can try to cough or shake your belly a little to wake up your little one. If the baby really refuses to cooperate, try again later. If you can't seem to get clear images, let us know as soon as possible so we can help you. Clean the probe with a damp cloth or a tissue after each use. This will help you get a clearer image the next time. Never rinse the baby watcher or use alcohol. This will damage it. Remember, the baby watcher is meant to experience something wonderful during your pregnancy. Listen to your body and don't use the baby watcher for medical purposes. 